Hello, last time I got a video um, indicate how to change the network from net public to private, but people still ask questions. For example, people ask, are you able to change the network from private to public? Well, this got some challenge to me, so I got another video for you, how to change network from public to private and vice versa in the other way, okay? So, for example, we have a network connected. This is our network uh, icon. If we right click and open the network sharing center, and if we look at here, this is our network. Look at here, network 4, and now it's indicated as private network. Okay, so there's no easy way to change it so now i'm going to show you one trick here in a registry if you type i-g-i-s-t-r-y <coughs> sorry let's type i-g-e-d-i-t this is the registry editor okay so say yes and uh, now you are in the registry editor so let's uh, go to the top of the tree so this is uh, going to be a tree so you expand the local network local machine and go to software meanwhile go to microsoft sure and go to windows windows nt Okay, I don't know why it's called Windows NT. Now go to current version. Okay, and go to network list. And go to profiles. Okay, if you expand those profiles and see all those network is the previous remembered network. Okay, it's a remembered network. Okay. So your goal is to find the network name exactly match the name here. This is your network 4. Okay. So now let's scroll down one, one by one and then look at the network 4. Okay. Here you go. Let me see network. Here's the network 4. Okay. Network 4. So what I'm going to do is let's go back to network network 4 okay then I'm going to disable my current network so I click change adapt the settings now here is my local network okay I'm going to disable it now I lost the network connectivity so be careful before you do that make sure you watch the whole video first so I disable it so now it's grayed out okay so let's go back to my network profile list so I'm going to find the network 4 okay here's my network 4 so I'm going to right click and uh, delete it. So are you sure permanent delete this subtree? Say yes. Okay, it's uh, disappeared. Now I don't have network 4 anymore. So let's go back to my network adapter list. So I'm going to enable this network again. Enable it. Okay, once you enable it instantly, you will see. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, it's disappeared. Sorry, you didn't see the notification. Uh, I'm going to do it again. So, disable. 
enable yeah I think uh, we didn't catch the notification tree let's do it again anyway so here let's go back to here what's network now it's still it's network 4 okay now it's changing to public anyway that's uh, I'm going to explain this one to you okay network 4 so uh, here I'm going to disable So let's refresh this one. Let's refresh anyway. Refresh. Okay. So after I refresh, I got network 4 again. So I'm going to delete it one more time. So it's not there anymore. So before I enable here my network here. I'm going to move my bar to the notification area so here is it. so now enabling so watch this yeah here you go yes or no yes or no so if you want is as a private you click yes if you want your network as a public you click no this is a trick right so now I'm going to say no, make it as a public. Here you go. So let's pop up my network again. Here you go. See, it's a public network now. And uh, you can do it one more time. You can, ch after that, you always has the ability to change yes or no to make it private or public. Okay. This is the whole video. I'm hoping you got the idea. Thanks for watching.